you here to kill me or to be my friend? Friend. Bye, Kosiwa. Ah, then your help, please. You are I as Magi, huh? Any other survivors? Only Damastis. They took him prisoner. And a scroll? What of the scroll? Damastis had it. That ass Damastis should have destroyed it. Cleopatra owes you much. Can you get to a healer by yourself? I've killed you, Doros. Huh? Well done. He was the snake, yes? Man to man, bike, there is much you have yet to understand. <laughs> man to man, I need an answer. I must take the measure of you first. Rescue the masters and recover the scroll. Pardon and me? then I will know if you're the man that I acclaim you to be. Where is this Damastis? He should be on the docks in Kalnopos Harbor. I can't risk that someone reads the scroll he carries. Urias, 
Sparische Vasen, Matadunkla ist drin. Ay, was kommt du hier los, Ben? Da dann kennst du, was du hast, du gehst auch, du bist so. Apollodorus sent me to help you. Give me the scroll. Scroll? I do not have any scroll. Your job was to carry it. I hid it on our ship. I did not want it to fall into the wrong hands. Where is the ship? At the bottom of the lake. They sank it. Ah, very well. I will get it. Apollodorus is waiting for you at the lighthouse. I will tell him to find you near the sunken ship. You are a capable man, someone I may be able to trust. The scroll was meant for the Roman general Pompey in an effort to sway Rome to Cleopatra's side. She will be grateful to you for keeping the communication secret. She is at my estate. We're headed there now. How does I have fit into all this? Her cousin Phanos informed me that she was a driven woman stalking deadly prey. It so happened that I also had reason to bring down this prey. When Aya was successful, I stepped in to protect her. We are grateful. And we are grateful that you have eliminated Eudorus. He was an odious individual. I should tell you that in addition to Eudorus, I put an end to the Philaketai of Alexandria, Gennadios. Gennadios? I am very glad he is dead. But it will cause serious problems for you. The Felakis are a tightly bound group. And murderers. They will certainly come after you. So be it. Can I ask why you wanted Eudorus dead? As you know, Cleopatra's brother, Ptolemy, is too young and pliable to be a strong leader. We believe Eudorus was the force behind Ptolemy responsible for so many of Egypt's current ills.
vida. The Queen enjoys the life of high society. I'm pleased that Aya is bringing some sober substance to Cleopatra's social circle. She is an extraordinary woman, your wife. I know. Bayek, before I can disclose all secrets, Cleopatra must meet and approve of you. She can be particular. Let me give you some advice. When you approach the Queen, bend your knee in deference. Speak only in reply. Yours is not to question, but to answer. Do not be distracted by the festivities. She has a large entourage, and they like to amuse themselves. Sometimes to excess. Speak clearly. In measured tones. Do not meet her gaze. Ready? I cannot wait. The sensation is most delightful. This way. She doesn't hold it out. Bees! Where is my opium pipe? I will sleep with anyone as long as they agree to be executed in the morning. <laughs> like Xantivis. He was well satisfied with his bargain. Who is this toothsome fellow? In Mehoto Ek Nebshevet. My queen, this is a... Uh... Well? It is a generous offer. But I've already pledged my life to this woman. Aya, you have chosen well. Come, we have much to discuss. Celebrate, my friends! <laughs> you were meant to kneel. <laughs> ah, Pashremta. Meet Aya and Bayek. They put an early end to Eudorus. Delightful. You are joining our efforts then. We do not know what your efforts are. Eudorus was a member of the Order of Ancients. They are responsible for my exile. They tore me from my throne. And why should I care about them? Well, the snake has many heads. Those heads make up the Order. The snake is the man who killed my son. He's not so simple. What are they talking about? I don't know. They must know something. The Order of Ancients seeks to control all Egypt. Ptolemy is but their puppet. We have informants in each region. But they have been unable to touch the order. Uh, across Egypt, mysterious forces work against us. For instance, here, in the Nile Delta, the endless sands swallow up whole villages, yet a malignant human force moves with them. That force is one of the order of ancients, called the Scarab. And over here, in most sacred Giza? A shadowy figure called the Hyena controls all that occurs. What is certain is that Giza is the land of death and loss. And then there's Memphis. All is cast in my land. Even the sacred Apis bull himself. One called the Lizard has worked a sort of diabolical power. So the snake is the order of ancients? Yes. Eudorus was known as the Hippo. You were right, my love. He was not the last one. All of these are. When the order wants something, as in Siwa, it does not hesitate to crush all in its path. For Siwa, now Fayum, it is the most oppressed region in all of Egypt. Where the crocodile wields cruel power, the denizens live in constant fear. That is the fate that awaits all Egypt if we fail to stop the order. We need decisive action. 
It is time for assassinations. We still have not found the man who killed Remo. Our sunshed will weep with joy when we clear the map of those figures. You are my Magi now. Protector of the true Pharaoh of Egypt. So it shall be. Tonight, we drink, celebrate, make love. Tomorrow. But she is so unreliable, probably batting her eyes at the master of arms. If I see her... Never mind her. I want my letter. Run up to the Pigeon Tower and fetch it. All news is important to us these days. All right, Stuart. I will see what I can do. Where's the body? 
masses of men prey on the weak and powerless. We cannot simply show our bellies to the jackals and plague our land. By the gods! Ruya! What happened? She was thrown to her death from the pigeon tower. Your letter. Why was she killed? That is the badge worn by Dimnos, our master of arms. Why did she have it? I will find out soon enough. Dimnos, I'm looking for Ruya. Perhaps because she has your badge. Shit. Well, she was just an Egyptian dog. No matter. Why did you do it? Truth? I didn't mean to kill her. Only teach her a lesson for her insolence. She refused to read a letter for me. You must confess to Pelias. I suppose you want the same fate as Ruya. You stupid Egyptian. I'll teach you the same lesson she learned. Come. Try. You will pay, corpse. Senseless tragedy. She was a smart girl with a good heart. I'm <laughs> 
seek the master brewer, Akuf. I have no time. Speak to one of my overseers if you must. You misunderstand. I am a Magi. Apollodorus sent me. Apollodorus, of course. He sent me for the scarab, the shadow that darkens size. Please, that is an evil name to speak aloud. Apollodorus knows that people are suffering. In my position, many confide in me. Trade is strangled, the soldiers run rampant, and the weight of Ptolemy's taxation crushes the breath from us. Come with me. Let us retire where we have a roof overhead. Give me another portion of dates. Have you had Macedonian dates? I tasted some from a merchant last time I was in Alexandria. Best I have There are many terrible stories about the scarab. I am sure Apollodorus told you. Tales of mutilation, disappearances, and folk buried in the desert and left to die. A horrendous fate, trapped in the shimmering sand, your mind and body pounded by the remorseless sun, waiting for the final release into the duat. But these are only stories. There are real villains in size. But the Scarab, if he exists, it is not safe to speak of him. The investigation to Hagu. about the scarab was near beaten to death, with his tongue cut out. <clears throat> Who was he? Paul Cooper, father-in-law to the most powerful man in the region, Mr. Harker. That boy, Kawab, is his grandson. <laughs> hey, you tired of winning? I'm looking for your grandfather. Do you know where he went? No. He left on the road to Camp Kiros. He should have been home by now. I'll see if I can find him along the road. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Pupa. I will get you out. I think you will survive. I know this scarab took your time, but we can help each other. Abkuf told me that you are investigating this scarab. Help me, and I can ensure he dies. summoning warriors to the city of Letopolis. By the gods, that is where my husband is. But the city swallowed by the desert. It is father's destiny to rebuild it. We're going to join him soon. Right, mother? Yes. My husband Haka has been sleeping there for months. I'm sure he can help you. He knows everyone there. If you go, tell him I can't wait to see him. Yeah, of course I will go. Yes, yes. Yeah. 